morning or afternoon Albert Rangers. This short video clip is just a little bit of help for us to um, get out of our own half um, from a goal kick. And um, I've set the pitch up here. Albert Rangers are the red. Number one is the goalkeeper. Number two is the central defender. Three and four are the wing backs. I have that job of getting up and down the pitch. Five and six midfield. And seven is our, our striker or attacker. Now from a goal kick, notice that we've got three players in their half. That's really important because if we don't have anybody in their half, we're going to struggle to actually get the ball up to them. And I want you to keep your eyes peeled for triangles as well. Because triangles help us with um, having options for passes. So look for times when players are making triangles because it's a good thing. So let's assume the goalkeeper has the ball and the goalkeeper passes to the de defender. Let's go there. So the goalkeeper passes to the defender. Now the defender has got um, options. The defender can pass to either side. There's that triangle again. The defender can travel forward if there's plenty of space. But really importantly, he's not trying to dribble past his own players because we've got three players in the other half. Let's move on. So the defender in this case has chosen to pass it out wide. And now we've got the wing backs. Now the wing backs, hopefully you've got lots of lovely space here to, to run into or to pass into. There's nothing wrong with passing the ball into space so that the strikers or midfielders can run onto it. So here he goes. That wing back is moving down the pitch. It's travelled into this advanced position. And now he's got a triangle. He's got options again. Because we've got a midfielder. We've got the centre forward or the striker. And he can choose what he's going to do. Might want to choose to shoot. But lots of options. And we've got four players in the opposition half. Now I'll come to the defenders in a minute because I forgot to move those. But in this case, uh, the wing backs passed it to the striker. Now, I forgot, should have mentioned this earlier actually. Um, pretty much as soon as the goal kick's taken place, the defenders, and the goal, including the goalkeeper, because remember the goalkeepers are part of the team, uh, can move right up. So we've got the goalkeeper on the um, edge of the area, so he can intercept if any balls come through. We've got the defender that's pushed right up to the halfway line so he can form triangles and help out with the passing and the playing. And even the wing back on the other side can push up, ready to receive the ball or ready to go back. So notice at this point, we've only just taken the goal kick, but we've got one, two, three, four, five, six players in the opposition half or five players in the opposition half and the defender on the halfway line. So we've really moved the play into the opposition's half. And we haven't got to, uh, so we've got lots more options. All those triangles in the opposition half. We haven't just got one person by themselves who's really isolated. And maybe, just maybe, we might get a shot on goal. So shall we watch that in uh, real time? Let's just have a quick look. Let's go to the menu. Let's go to 3D. OK, so here we are in Stadium Albert Rangers. And uh, let's just press play and see what happens. So, keeper to the defender. Makes a choice, passes it wide. Mazy run from the wing back. He's got his triangle, makes a pass. Don't forget, everyone's pushed up. And he can have a shot at goal. Now the good thing is, because if we get a fast counter, if the other team break into the space, we've always got one defender, at the very least. We've got our wing backs who can trap back and help. And because our goalkeeper is part of the team, part of the game, he's able to intercept if need be. So that's the plan. But um, it is just a plan, and games, of course, have lots of different uh, things that happen. And we, uh, this is just something to give us a bit of guidance. So I hope you've enjoyed this video and see you later. Bye.